you are going to pray you are still holding the hand of the person father enough is enough what kept my father kept my mother lord i come by the message of god it must break in my life lift your voice and cry lift your voice and cry lord enough is enough enough of failure enough of poverty enough of burying my loved ones something has to break loose Enough of struggling ministry. Enough of struggling my spiritual life. Pray, pray, pray. Let fire burn in this place. Let fire burn in this place. Let fire, fire burn in this place. And you are about to use it now ha. and he showed me joshua the high priest standing before the lord and the accuser came before him attempting to rail accusations and he said is this not a reed that i have taken out of fire and he said the lord rebuke you listen the mercy of god is a weapon you can use it and say satan satan I know you are supposed to destroy me but what about this i present to you the mercy of god i present to you the blood of the eternal covenant i present to you the advocacy of jesus at the right hand of the father standing and speaking i present to you the sinless blood i present to you calvary Shake your voice. Invoke mercy. Hey, Invoke mercy. Repata peke 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 Hallelujah. 
enemy tonight you are going to use it as a weapon over the devourer I know I've not been a titer you are authorized to destroy me but see the blood when I see the blood when I see the blood when I see the blood you should be destroyed but the blood will speak hear me you live the wayward life and all kinds of things happen and the earth cries against you but when I see the blood when I see the blood you were involved in all kinds of blood covenants and fraternities in ignorance but now that you are in Christ when I see the blood lift up your voice and plead the blood hey! invoke mercy, mercy. come on now Hallelujah. Hear me. The Bible says, blotting out every handwriting. There are handwritings. There are records kept in the realm of the spirit that testify that you should not live long. There are records in the realm of the spirit that testify that you should not be blessed. There are records in the realm of the spirit that testify that you should not have any child again. The devil says you wasted all your children and all of them have gone. There is a record in the realm of the spirit that says you have misused all the opportunities that you were given. But tonight, plead the blood. It can blot it out. Come on now. It can blot it out. It can blot it out. It can blot out covenant. It can blot out covenant. It can blot out covenant. Hear me. Hear me. 
the keeper. Listen, listen, listen. Listen. When you activate this, you will find out that no longer will there be an accusation to say, oh, you once in, were in the world, you committed 19 abortions and blood is speaking and that's why your life is not moving. It should not move. But now that you have invoked mercy, it makes the cause causeless. That means it should not come again. Are we together? You stole money. Help them, please. And all of that, you destroyed another person's destiny. But, but now that you are in Christ, what of the blood? He showed me Joshua the high priest. Please take seriously. This is what I did for my own life. Oh, let me tell you. For we rise to our access to mysteries in the kingdom. I want to pray for you. But we are going to pray one more prayer point. Hear me. And say, I begin a new order. A new order. Dissociated from the past. Alienated from the witchcraft and causes and yoke by the blood of the eternal God. When only are you praying? Alienated. Every biological disorder. Every genetic disorder. Every yoke that made you in one minute I'd like you to cry and say Lord I am like those virgins but I want to be a wise one give me oil in my lamp I need grace and real genuine anointing for ministry tired of acting like I'm anointed when I am not tired of hoping it works when it can be guaranteed to work are you praying please pray from the depth of your heart Hallelujah. I want to pray a prayer for you. And I want you to believe you came far. And I want to release something upon you. Tomorrow, please, whatever it is, I don't want you to miss tomorrow. There are people in that parable who were called the sellers of the oil. 
not just because they collected money but they were given custody that if your oil finishes you can go they sell it the man said it it was it's not pride he said it he said there are people who can that means the wise one got it from there the oil does not just fall from the sky there are those who are privileged by God's grace to be given that ministry of supplying oil and that's the prayer I want to pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ I decree over your life that every dimension you have desired spiritually in the name that is truly above all names may that grace may that fire may that oil rest upon you now please just help them don't bring anybody out we don't have the time in the name of jesus christ man of god look at me i'm seeing something being poured on your head this man i stretch my hands to you in the name of Jesus, you step into a new level of grace right now. A new level of oil by the power of the Holy Spirit. Lord, every empty, every empty lamb, I send by the Spirit of God fresh oil. You will know oil is entering your lamp. Entering the prophetic ministry, entering the apostolic ministry, fresh oil on that prayer life, fresh oil, Habarako Salika Prahasedegetash, fresh oil in the name of Jesus Christ. every weariness spiritually you love the lord but you know that it is it, it seems like this lamp is, is is about to die in the name of jesus i come by the spirit let there be a supply let there be a supply for the visions you used to see and the dreams you used to have they were so powerful they blessed men but something happened and the lamp began to go down in the name of Jesus like the hair of Samson I command an activation by the oil of the spirit in the name of Jesus Christ and lastly I pray for you There are many of you who truly are zealous for the word. You are ardent students of the word. But the grace for performance is not in your life. There are many things you, vo you vocalize. You verbalize. Some of you may even be men of God sincerely. There is a grace that makes for performance. It's more than stories. If it's not there, it's not there. I pray for you finally by the supply of the spirit. That when your eyes see it and your mouth declares it, let the spirit that brings performance rest upon your life. We believe you are mightily blessed. To connect with the ministry and get more from Apostle Joshua Selman, follow us on Facebook and Twitter at Koinonia ENI to stream Koinonia Live. Go to mixella.com forward slash Koinonia hyphen radio and download the teachings on koinoniadownloads.org. For questions and inquiries, call 0814-721-4444 or 907 We love and celebrate you. God, find a corner for yourself. In the next five minutes, we are going to blast in the spirit. Instrumentalists help us. We are going to pray. Just find a place alone for God's sake. With God, cry your heart this night to God and say, Father, something is wrong. I need stability in my life. Lift your voice and pray.
Mandas Kadapa Hassan Makata, Sengete Ketekete, Ebra Kapesko Parakapo Sengete, Nante Kaskoma Tande Senekata. There is something wrong, O oh God. I don't have a personal encounter with you. Help me, O oh God. Today I think I'm born again. Tomorrow I'm not sure again. I need a personal encounter. Pray. Give me a personal encounter. A personal encounter. A personal encounter. In the name of Jesus. Pray. Pray, pray outside. Make sure you are praying. You are following online. Pray. Lord, restore my values. Restore my foundational values. Restore my foundational values. Restore it. The values I kept when I started with you. The values I kept when you started using me. The values I kept when the anointing started coming upon my life. The values I kept that gave me revelation, influence. Restore, oh God. Restore, oh God. Restore, oh God. You are a man of God here, pray, pray, Lord what am I missing, pray, Lord what am I missing, what has my growth in the spirit taken from my life, what am I missing, what about prayer am I missing, what about fasting am I missing, what about the body of the world am I missing? What about character am I missing? Shalakaparokatoskabarakasalas. Ekretoskatapakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakatoskabarakato